Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to your tarot reading for Tuesday, May 12th, 2020. I'm sorry I've been away for so long, but I actually did come down with the COVID virus. And for the past two weeks, I've just been really sick. Um, I can't even describe or explain it to you. Um, however, I am feeling better. I started feeling better like four days ago. And since then, I've gradually um, become more strong and um, more of an ability to speak and breathe. And I'm really grateful and thankful for that. Um, today is going to be my first day doing readings um, once again. And it's going to be my first day going back to work in two weeks. And I'm looking forward to both. So I did get a new deck of cards while I was sick. I had nothing else I could do except lay in bed. <clears throat> maybe sit up for a little bit and just focus on breathing. And so at that point in time, I found a couple of pairs of uh, decks that I really, really um, was drawn to. This one was from actually a friend of mine who was doing a reading for me named Lori. Um, she was using this deck and it just um, really spoke out to me. So I made sure to go out and um, look for it online and purchase it. So <clears throat> let's get today's reading in today. Um, you may notice my voice still fades in and out a little bit, and I still have a little bit of um, a hoarseness to it, <clears throat> and I'm apologizing for that, but um, this virus is something else. Um, trust me, I wouldn't want to go through it again, and I hope you guys don't have to go through it at all. So let's see what we have for COD, shall we? What's the energy going to be by um, for this day, this Tuesday, May 12th? And I think we're good to go. Let's put these decks cut down and see what's going on, right? Our first pile, our second pile, and finally now, the last pile. So I'm just gonna take a sip of tea here. That does help a lot, believe it or not. Um, today, I'm kind of drawn to this first pile. The reason being, first time I'm using a deck, my first day back at work in two weeks. So let's see what this day of firsts is going to be all about, shall we? All right, and we have the Seven of Cups. So let's talk a bit about the Seven of Cups. Um, first off, it's Minor Arcana, so it's all going to be about how we respond to situations and how we actually are looking at things, number one. Number two, when we look at the seven, um, the number seven also coincides with um, the major arcana card, number seven, which is the chariot. Um, so a lot of that energy from the chariot gets drawn off into this card as well for our day. So when we look at this card, some things that do come to mind that we want to consider. First and foremost, you have a lot of options, obviously. We have all of these things going on. There are a lot of options available to us. We have choices. We have potential um, possibilities going on, a lot of opportunities. So it's all about that. Now, with the energy of the chariot, Let's look at this and say, hey, we, we need to take control. Although we do have all of these options available to us, one thing we're not and we shouldn't do is procrastinate. We want to take some control over the situation and determine uh, which one of these options is going to be better for us. Now, along with that, um, Cups is always about emotions, right? It's always about how we feel and um, things of that nature. So if we are going to be picking and choosing an option, we don't want to procrastinate, of course, right? Um, but we do want to go with our intuition. We do want to um, put aside, for now anyway, that intellect and um, what um, our logic is dictating to us. And go so long with um, what's actually intuitively um, that voice inside of us is saying, because that's where we need to be and that's where we want to be. And with this energy of this card, it will all work out well. So I think this is a pretty cool reading for a Tuesday. Um, my first reading in two weeks. I'm really glad to be back. I look forward to doing this again tomorrow, the day after and the day after that. And um, until then, be safe, be well, and as always, be blessed.